Hello everybody and welcome to my home for today's Costco haul. We're starting with the frozen items so I can get these things into the freezer as quickly as possible. I've got some chicken nuggets here. These ones were two kilos for $20.99. I've got these for Sophie mainly, but mind you, they're great to chuck in things like wraps and stuff as opposed to tenders because I like cutting up my tenders anyway, but we're trying not to have takeaway this week. So best of luck to me with the party pies and sausage rolls. These are one of Dylan's absolute favorites. They come in two separate boxes, 88 pieces in total, and this is also $20.99. These pork buns are incredible if you haven't had them before. I picked them up quite regularly. They're $12.99 for the box and you get two packets of six, so 12 in total. The next things I want to get unpacked are the fridge items. I picked up eggs and 30 of these are $8.99. As per usual, I picked up four milks. The reason I pick up four milks is because that's what can fit in my fridge. Otherwise, I'd probably buy more because I'm gonna need more, but these are $3.59 for three liters. The probiotic drink comes in four packs of five, so 20 in total, and you get that for $11.99. I picked up some shredded cheese. This just works best for our family. It's $9.89 for 750 grams of the Chia Tasty Shred, which is formerly known as Coon Cheese. But this bad boy is just so easy to freeze as well. I would recommend putting it on things like pizzas and stuff like that because the texture does change a little bit. But for the cocktail frankfurts, you do get three individual packages, which totals to a complete 1.5 kilos. Obviously, that works out to be 500 gram portions that they've split it up for me. So I'm going to cut it here because it's easier to fit in my fridge. The whole 1.5 kilos will cost you $7.99. I want to be having stir fries a lot this fortnight, so I picked up some hockey noodles. There's two kilos here, split up into one kilo individual packages, so two packages. I got the whole thing for $6.99. We completely went through the chicken from last fortnight, of course, so I picked up another chicken breast. This whole package here cost me $20.44. The ground beef mince is just a staple in our family. I do recommend when you pick these up from Costco because the cling film is quite thin. You can see from the corner there that it's torn. It tears for me almost every time. So make sure that you are wrapping it in those bags that they bring bring give you <laughs> the whole package of ground beef cost me $31.37 which is $10 a kilo we always love having croissants on hand it's such an easy snack it's great to have with breakfast and things like that of course I have frozen half here which I do like to do quite regularly however I shouldn't have done it straight away I should have waited to see how many we ate and then froze the remainder so a little tip for you there because we smashed through the ones I left out fresh and we're about to start defrosting the other ones and it's like not even 24 hours later. These usually cost you $11.99 for the full package, but it did have a rebate of $3.
I'm constantly needing diced tomatoes for my cooking so I decided to grab a whole tray of these as opposed to grabbing the individual ones that I usually would do from like Woolworths or Coles. Here I have 12 400 gram cans and the whole thing only cost me $11.89. This thing I keep here is actually for soft drinks for your fridge. I think it's called like a fridge buddy or something, but I like to use it for cans in my pantry. It just makes it a lot easier. Sophie's special treats for this fortnight, which you're about to see me give her one because she was so excited when she saw the packaging. These were $11.99 for the whole thing. The whole package is 630 grams. They come with 30 packets inside and of those 30 packets, each individual one is 21 grams. So I will show you the size of the individual biscuits, but I have to tell you, they are amazing. I'm just having flashbacks of my teenage years eating these. Winter is here and so is the cold weather. So we've been eating so many oats lately. I did pick up another one of these Uncle Toby's instant oats. This whole box is gonna cost you $22.99. It comes with six individual packets. There is 350 grams in these individual packets. In each individual packet, you've got a whole bunch of servings. We've got four honey, we've got three golden syrup and three brown sugar with cinnamon. I love these tiny teddies. I love to eat them. Sophie loves to eat them. So they're her little snack, but they're mine too. So the whole package is going to cost you $13.39. Within the box, you get 14 chocolate, you get 14 honey, and you get 14 of the choc chip. The whole package is just over a kilo. I've been learning to bake my own bread lately. I picked up five kilos of plain flour for $4.49. I grabbed three kilos of the white sugar for $2.99. And these baby mum that I picked up for my daughter, they are $8.99 for the whole package and you get 72 biscuits inside. I needed some more downy in wash scent beads and I picked up this scent. It's cool cotton, which I'd never tried before, but I'm really excited because it smells amazing. The whole package is just over a kilo and that will set you back at $31.99. The cereal of choice for this fortnight was Nutrigrain. I didn't mind this because if there was lots left over and it was starting to go bad, I could make like Nutrigrain bars out of them. For 1.2 kilos, I picked that up for $9.99. I picked up a huge thing of toilet paper. There's 48 rolls in here from Quilton and the whole thing's gonna set you back $19.49. I almost forgot to show you that I did pick up a big box of the Infusions Veggie Chips. This is the sour cream and herb flavor. You get 40 packets, 600 grams in total, but each individual packet is 15 grams. I've linked my entire Costco haul playlist down below for you guys if you wanted to watch a few more. But if you're new here, I'd love it if you subscribe and join our little community. I have a new Costco haul coming at least once a fortnight for you guys and a whole bunch of other homemaking inspiration, of course. So love you. Have the best week.